So here, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to welcome you to today's presentation sponsored by the Society of Decision Professionals, which is entitled Big Data, Little Thinking. Okay, so Big Data and Little Thinking, uh, and then the subtitle there, but Swimming in New Foundations of Information, Try Not to Drown. So mostly the, the talk today is, is about caution that needs to be exercised when, when using big data. So the, from the title, you might guess that, that I'm going to express some skepticism about, um, about the approach of using big data. And you might say, well, what's so bad about having lots of data? Um, and, and in general, there's nothing wrong with having lots of data. In fact, it's quite a boon to have the access to the amount of data we have these days, as well as the ability to analyze so much data, but there are a few cautionary notes to throw out there. The first one that I'm going to talk about is you need to know what kind of situation you're in. It's worth distinguishing between what I'm calling data-driven situations versus data-seeking ones. Data-driven situations are situations in which the strategy that you're developing or the decisions that you're going to make are largely founded on and driven by the current situation. And therefore, the better you can understand the current situation and what led up to the current situation, the better chance you're going to have of making a really good decision. But that doesn't describe all situations. 